Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here, and we are back in Timberborn. All right, guys. So we are a little ways through, a little ways through a bad tide. We're a little over halfway through it. We're making it. Uh, we've got 1.2 thousand water. We've got a thousand food. Everything's looking yeah, fairly good. We've got a little bit of a water and hole left over here. We still got a pretty decent water hole over here and back over here we still have some more water as well so we have some things going for us we are actually building up our dynamite we've got 23 pieces at the moment which is excellent trying to get this over here blasted out so that we have a little bit extra water going for this one let's go ahead and get the speed turned up so that they can keep building trying to get our next power area set up so that we can build uh build our, our ration plan, our food facility, whatever it's called. What is it called? Uh, food factory. There we go. That's what it's called. Very nice. Very, very nice. And I'm hoping that that raises it up just high enough that it's going to allow the uh, allow the water to turn the wheels. Hopefully it is. If not, we'll end up raising it up one, but I'm hoping we don't have to go there. Because if I can avoid that, that'd be very nice. Hmm. And then we got this over here. Yeah, so we've got a couple of things for them to work on. Really, what I need to do is we've got two unemployed. I was going to say maybe we need to get another another builder. But if I do another builder, let's see, that's going to be a district over there once we get everything situated. So I really need to put another builder's hut over here. Somewhere. Mm, we might be able to put it right here over the top of this. I'd have to blast it out, though, before we could put it there. But we could do that. Why don't we do that? Why don't we do... I'll set this up. We will increase the priority of that. We'll get that blasted. And then I'll build, I'll build a platform over the top of this. Oh, actually, I don't even need to. That's already big enough okay never mind uh they can still blast that but let's see hauling pose no nope, builder's hut right there so let's put it yeah let's put it facing this direction and then i guess let's increase all of that so that we can get it built and we can get a couple extra builders going In fact, let's lower these two because I don't need these two built just yet. Yeah, lower those, build everything else because we really need to get that other house built, the other barracks built as well.
Okay, just need a builder to poke it. Nice. Okay, so we'll do that. Uh, let's come back over here and... You know what? I kind of think... How do I want to do this? Do I want to just... I think I want to blast that out. Yeah, do that, and then let's throw in, let's see, we, ooh, we really need to get these guys, huh? Oh, we don't have the treated planks, though. Okay, yeah, so let's throw in a couple of breeding pods over here. That way we can start turning this into a district, because this is almost to that point where it can become its own district. I say that, we don't got no campfires or anything, but we're working on it. We're getting there. It's a thing. It'll happen eventually. Okay, so we've got that. So we don't have any more homeless. And we still have a lack of beavers, though. So that's still a thing. Uh, we're down to 600-something water. We've got 1.8 days left. That one's dried up. That one's dried up. And that one is still pumping a little bit. And this guy's dried up. Okay. So not the best, not the worst. Uh, let's go ahead and put in... We'll put in the ladder over here. And I'd like to come back in with the dynamite. And we'll just knock that down a level. Okay, do we have the dynamite placed over here? Yes, we do. Blast that down one more spot. Good. All right. Now we've got more beavers coming. Excellent. That's still keeping this all nice and clean. Why are we not getting rid of these trees? I'll have a... No, there's not a cut order on them. Focus on the mangroves for a minute. This one's still going to cause a problem, isn't it? There it goes. Eh. 
And of course, we don't have a dude over there. Why do we not have a dude over there? Because we have 10 vacancies. Why do we have so many vacancies? Old age, old age, old age, old age. And we had a bunch die of old age. Okay. Well, that is unfortunate. That is very, very, very unfortunate. But that's okay, because we're going to get everything going again. Did we get everything over here? Almost. We were just missing one dynamite. Much better. Okay, so we'll blast this one open, and that'll probably guarantee that we have plenty of water inside that hole. And then we'll just have to expand the rest of these. Too far, huh? They'll probably get it once I start building. And already with a bad tide approaching. Wow. Yeah, we need to send some water the other direction good that one's not flowing Just keep it flowing this direction for a minute. Okay. That ought to help get us some water over here to this other side. Even if it's just for a bit. Very nice. Okay, good. So we've deepened this pocket over here. We deepen the other ones. I really need to get this one going. Let's see. We've got we've got just a little bit of dynamite left. So yeah, I think we're just gonna go ahead and blast out this one this one little spot over here. And hopefully these pumps will be able to keep going and maintain maintain themselves to this next bad tide. Okay, where's there it is.
One day left before the drought. Or the bad tide. Come on, throw the last few pieces of dynamite over here. help some Alright, build that, and then let's see, food factory, how big, ooh, that's a big boy, isn't it? Is it going to connect if I put it right there? Yeah, I think it will. Yeah, we'll still have to blast it a little bit over here to get this down, but that's okay. 900 I do got 900 you know what we do have we do have bad water where's my extract that's my extract yeah let's go ahead and learn the double we're gonna learn that we're gonna place that thing we're gonna get stuff built it's gonna be great We got a 26 day bad tide. Ooh. build that food factory then we'll be able to start making corn rations set up one more for corn just so we can hold more and then we'll do the corn ration corn rations right there we'll do that then we'll come over here and we'll set up a corn ration for this side
So what do we need left? We just need one more plank. Nice. And yes, do corn rations. Still missing eight beavers. We got in, one incapacitated. Oh, they got injured. Yeah, that figures. Okay. Just had to check which buildings were were having issues. Those are too deep. Mm. I don't know if I want to destroy that or not. I might want to fill that spot in. Just maybe. That's unfortunate that we're already down to this pool of water, but we do have it all deeper over here, so that is still a good amount to pull from, so not too bad, not too bad. Yeah, all of our deep water is starting to, starting to show a little bit better. All right, and the corn rations have begun. The beavers can now enjoy their corn. Let's see. Well, these come over here. Let's grab some of the stuff for well-being. Um... lantern up here put a shrub all that stuff takes metal which we can still do yeah we got a little bit of metal I don't know. We'll increase it. It'll get better. I'm thinking... Maybe we go ahead and just get rid of this whole little area right there. And I might put some... Uh, I don't know if I want to put 
campfires over here if I want to put them over here I could do it on either or but this land is green technically if I were to put a barrier I could put the uh, the crops on it hmm of course then again during a drought that runs dry though so that won't stay green. Well, it stays a little green because of this. Not a lot. I don't know. Maybe it would. Good. That's out of the way. Yeah, I guess let's put two campfires in. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. So... Trying to think of what else we really need over here. I mean, of course we need to get some more uh, cassava and we need to get soybeans going and all that. The soy going and all that. Or is it soy or is it canola? What is it? Hold on. Uh, crops. Cassava. Oh no, it is soybean and canola. Yeah, we gotta get all those going too. I don't know. I think you would increase production if we did split it up into two districts. I think that's what we need to do. I just want to make sure this district is situated. Oh, I need some more water tanks. That's what I need. That's what I need. I need another big water tank over here. I get another big water tank and we'd probably be in business. Yeah, let me do that. Let me get some big water tanks over here. I'm not sure where I want to put them just yet, but we do need them. Yeah, we'll figure out where to put those, but... Anyway, I think that is going to be it for today's video, guys. We got, we got quite a bit done today. So we finally got our ration food factory plant going. We've got, they're making making corn rations. We've got our new power source. We've got more housing. We've got extra amenities going in. We've deepened our water reserves. Uh, I think it'll be all right. So starting to increase our population a little bit. We'll see how that goes. Hopefully we won't hit another massive beaver die off. But I think we're I think we're a little bit more stable than we have been in the past, so I think it should it should hold out a little bit better. Like I said, I just need to get a couple more medium water tank storages over here, and then I think we could split this into a separate district, and then we'll see what things happen. But anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. I do hope everyone has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button, and if you haven't already do me a favor hit that subscribe button it is an awesome way for you to show your support to me to the channel to the video and to the game itself and as always feel free to share that video on a, on any social media you're using you guys just like to stop take a moment and thank each and every one of y'all 
for all your wonderful, awesome support. All the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome, and I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.